Hey y'all, it's Dan. Name of the channel is Numerical Lion, where I use Gematria to reveal the false reality in which we live in. For those that don't know, you can come to this calculator. It's called it's at gematrinator.com, created by a name named Derek, who at first was a critic of the work from Zachary K. Hubbard about Gematria, and then he put it to practice and discovered the merit to it. Anyway, if you type in, basically there's four base ciphers, English ordinal, reduction, reverse ordinal, and reverse full reduction. English ordinal is the alphabetical order. A is one, B is two, etc. Z is 26. Reduction means that the letters get busted down to a single number. So instead of Z being 26, Z is 8, 2 plus 6 is 8, and then there's reverse ordinal where it's just what it means. A is now 26 and Z is 1. Reverse order is A would now be 8 from 26 and Z remains 1. So that's a little crash course on it. The only way to really know it is to practice it and decode stories like this. The world is scrambling to buy ventilators. In the COVID-19 pandemic, one country has only four of them for 12 million people. So more fear, you know, this is what the media does. More fear, anxiety. People probably don't even read these articles. They just read the, the headline. So COVID-19 cases have topped 2.2 million globally. And countries around the world are scrambling to buy life-saving equipment as the pandemic places unprecedented demand on hospitals. With healthcare systems buckling under the pressure of the virus, which has killed more than 155,000 people. Interesting that they put this number in there. I'll tell you why. Coronavirus equals 155. That's why. Experts warn coronavirus could devastate the countries that lack health care equipment and infrastructure. South Sudan, for example, I didn't even know South Sudan was a country, but anyway, has just four ventilators and 24 ICU beds for a population of 12 million people. 12, 24, 12 plus 12 is 24. 24, the reflection of 42, a number they like to code on black people. Most you know, black people live in the Sudan. So, so there's one, and later on in the story they talk about there's one ventilator for every 3 million people. One region under close watch is Africa, which has recorded more than 12,400 cases since the first confirmed instance of coronavirus was recorded in Egypt on February 14th, according to the WHO. So Africa, February, why is that interesting? You know, February, Black History Month, the only month that sums to 42. All right, also 120 and 48, like quarantine. February 14th is Valentine's Day. Valentine's Day. 74, gotta get their 74 in there. Also pandemic 151. Pandemic 151. So that's what that's all about. And then they say it was recorded in Egypt. Why Egypt? It's all by this code. E. I don't know how to spell Egypt. Oh, here we go. <laughs> 73 and 62, like sacrifice. Like Mason, 17, like kill. Mason, also 17. Oh, same numbers as Egypt. Talking about Mason. The Masons. Story of Hiram Rabiff. Secret societies. So this was the headline. Country of 12 million has only four ventilators. 12 and four. Notice that whenever you see headlines like this, fooling around with the numbers, and 
There's a cipher called Francis Bacon, who, they're talking about the World Health Organization, not the band, equals one, two, four, right? And it happened on Valentine's Day, a reworking of 214, right? Anyway, Francis Bacon is with capitalized letters. You add 26 to the letter. So W, the 23rd letter of the alphabet, you add 26 to H, which is the eighth letter of the alphabet. You add 26 to O, the 15th letter, you add 26 to, you add it up. One, two, four. A country of 12 million has only four ventilators. Also, if you write out the WHO World Health Organization equals 412, kind of like 124, right? Also, they're talking about Valentine's Day or 214, 214. Also, the world would say, you know, 14 slash 2, which is coronavirus. And Africa equals one, two, four, right? Didn't they say there's 12,400 cases in Africa? <laughs> and Africa equals 124? Just a coincidence. Look at coronavirus and ventilators, both at 155. I mentioned this was a story about ventilators and coronavirus and 155,000 people. What did it say in the story? 155,000 people. Oh, it's killed more than 155,000 people. So 155,000 people. Ventilators equals 155, just like coronavirus. Also 56, like ventilators, 47, the reflection of 74, also ventilators with the V, um, V reduction is 74, 142, like Valentine's Day, 2 slash 14, 14 slash 2, both 70 as well. Coronavirus and ventilators goes hand in hand, it's happened in South Sudan, same numbers, 142 and 56. Just like coronavirus, just like ventilators. And this story comes out on a day with 42 numerology, right? More N word programming. Forty-two, you write out forty-two and you get one forty-two, also seventy-four, like coronavirus, forty-three and thirty-eight, like pandemic. So COVID-19, and they're talking about ICU beds, both 63 and 36, same ciphers. Another coincidence, Africa equals 38 and 43. Seeing these numbers time and time again. Pandemic, 38 and 43. The World Health Organization equals 308 or 38. Murder, death, killing. Story comes out on the 109th day of the year. It's interesting because 109 is the 29th prime. And we're talking about Africa. That's pretty much what they're mentioning in the story. It's mainly countries in Africa. I mean, they talk about everywhere in the world, but mostly they, they talk about Africa in this story. About 12 million, four ventilators for that number of death. So there you go. More news by numbers. Learn the code and apply it. And you can see through the deception. Thanks so much. Have a great night, everybody.